Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. According to the US Sun, Jackie has aligned herself with Team Teresa Judas and has been seen socializing with Teresa's close friend Jennifer Aiden following her rift with Margaret. Regarding their feud, Margaret commented, I don't think it's about taking sides, but rather that Jackie and I aren't as tight as we once were. Addressing their strained relationship that allegedly began during Dolores Catania's annual softball game, filmed for the new season of RHONA. A source previously revealed that Margaret and Jackie had gotten into an argument over the mom of four's new book, The Weight of Beautiful. The insider spilled. Jackie gave out copies of her book to a few cast members, but Margaret did not get one, and that made her question their friendship. Jackie alleges that Margaret is attempting to take credit for securing the book deal, but insists it was their shared publicist, introduced by Margaret to Jackie, who facilitated the deal. Despite being demoted to a friend of the housewives in the latest season, the author has embarked on a press and book tour to promote her memoir. Released at the end of September, Margaret addressed the ongoing feud with Jackie at the Global Lime Alliance, GLA, gala held at Cipriani in New York City on October 12, stating, I've already published my own book, so there's no envy involved. I only wanted really good things for her, the Macbeth Collection founder admitted. For now, it seems like it will take time before the ex-besties become friends again, if that's their fate. Margaret responded, I think we were always close. I think that we will always have that love for each other, but I think right now we just have to see where it goes. While filming for season 14 has yet to conclude, the New Jersey native teased what's to come. I think it's still a crazy season as it always is. I think there's new ships in different relationships, which is very interesting to me. Margaret expressed optimism about the reception of her upcoming work, stating, I believe people will find it enjoyable. We've always had a knack for surprising everyone. Known for her close friendship with Melissa Gorga, Margaret finds herself amidst a family feud between Melissa and Teresa Judas. Sources reveal that Jackie remains friends with Melissa, but their relationship has been strained due to Melissa's close ties with Margaret amid the tension with Teresa. Despite this, both Melissa and Teresa attended Jackie's recent book signing event in New Jersey, although Melissa reportedly made a brief appearance of only five to ten minutes. The ongoing rift between the sisters-in-law has led them to actively avoid each other and refuse to communicate during filmed cast events, as previously reported. When asked if Margaret believes a big fight will break out on the cast trip, taking place soon in the Berkshires, she told the U.S. Sun she doesn't think so. I don't see it happening. I think that ship has sailed, and I think there's nothing more to discuss, the TV personality reasoned. Dollaries, who also attended the GLA Gala, agreed with her co-star and told us, I don't see any fight. Jersey is always very unpredictable, so I couldn't tell you. Every day is different. Every day it's easier to predict the weather than what's going to happen on Jersey. As filming is expected to wrap by the end of October, Margaret reflected on the crazy year it has been so far. She remarked, Listen, it's been a crazy year. Besides the added stress so far, we are pretty healthy. We try and maintain our health and everything else. But emotionally, we've had a crazy year. I'll put it that way. The clothing designer was referring to her husband, Joe Begnino, who attended the GLA gala with her. The fundraiser garnered more than $1.6 million for Lyme and tick-borne disease research and awareness. Orchestrated by Larry Scott of Lawrence Scott Events, the evening was highlighted by a visit from celebrity ambassador Christopher Maloney and a musical performance by Debbie Gibson. Margaret emphasized the significance of the event, stating, It's crucial because I have a friend battling Lyme disease. We must prioritize finding a cure for this hidden pandemic as it profoundly impacts those affected.